Hey guys, it's Working Wednesday. So welcome to my channel. It's Working Wednesday. It's Working Wednesday. It's Working. <laughs> so it's Working Wednesday, which is my favorite day of the week. If you're new, welcome. If you're an existing subscriber, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lexi. I've got so many new subscribers, and I really do appreciate every single one of you guys. If you don't know, on my channel, I do a, a Wednesday series called Working Wednesdays, um, where I talk about a different job that I've had. So check out my previous Working Wednesdays. Wednesday videos so this video is about working as a dietary aide so stay tuned So the job description is actually um, you work inside of a nursing home. So you can wash, you wash dishes, you prepare food trays. We had like a dining area, so we were like waitresses to the residents. Um, some of them you have to walk around and see what they want to eat, go to the different like rooms. But mine wasn't like that. So that was basically the job description. It was a really simple job. All right, so for my pros, I would have to say the people that I worked with. I worked with some amazing people while working as a dietary aide, and yeah, I really enjoyed their time and their company, and yeah, they were amazing. The food. my All my coworkers could cook their ass off. I mean, like, cook so good. I would eat free breakfast, free lunch, free dinner, and we were all in there getting so fat from working there, but the food was so good. Um, getting to know the older people. So I love getting to know older people and hearing their stories about different things So that's why I enjoyed that aspect of it. I would have to yeah. say another pro was I had a uniform So I didn't have to worry about like what to put on for work And I didn't really care really because I had a, like a thing on my head that covered my hair and everything up So that was good as well A con would have to be my hours So at first I was getting a lot of hours and then they just shut down and I wasn't getting that many hours I remember I would like look for another job and while I was still working there because I wasn't getting hours, but then it eventually picked back up. The drive from my house was like 45 minutes, which I put as another kind. Um, yeah, so I like to stay in the vicinity of my, like where I live at, in case my car breaks down, anything happens, even for the commute. Like who wants to drive a whole hour to work? Nobody. Um, people pass, so it was a guy there, his name, I'll call him P. Um, he was a really cool guy or whatever. And you know, he, seem to be doing well like we used to have to give him puree food which is kind of like baby food but his the granddaughter used to bring him regular food to eat all the time and i went out of town for like three days or something and when i came back he was on hospice meaning that he was passing away and i still my feelings still get so hurt right now because it just goes to show you that life is so so short no matter how healthy you may look on the outside you may not be that healthy on the inside so it just depends and yeah so that part I would say was a con. I could never be like a nurse or a CNA or anything like that because I was just in the kitchen and I was getting attached to these people. Even if I didn't speak to them like that, I knew who they were. I spent my most of my time with them because I was always at work. So, washing dishes. So, if y'all know I do not like washing dishes. If you watch my video about Starbucks, I don't like washing dishes. But luckily, we had like a dishwasher. I like to scrape the plates, but I don't like to do the other part. Like, I didn't want to pick up the dishes. I did not want to push them through either. I just like to scrape them. That's it. Didn't really like that, but whatever. Also, you have to sweep the floors and mop floors as well. Um, the guys normally did that. If the guys wasn't there, I was not around to do it. So, yeah, that's it for that. Um, so success in this role, I would have to say, would be to just learn the process. Um, you know, once you learn a process or you um, continuously do something, you get fast at it. Be fast at preparing trays, be fast at washing dishes, be fast at everything that you do so that you can, you know, be a joy to work with. Like people can enjoy working with you. It's always those people that go slow as heck and everybody's like, okay, I have to work with such and such tonight. But you don't want to be that person. Um, it wasn't really room to move up. You can move on to the lead position, I believe, but I don't even think it paid more money. But yeah, so I was only there for like almost a year because I moved to Georgia right after the fact. And... That's it for that position. If you want to apply for this position, um, I applied through a paper app because one of my friends, she worked there as a CNA and she told me they were hiring. So I applied it with the paper app. But you can definitely apply online at your location if they have it online. Or you can stop in and, let, and see if they're hiring or anything like that. Yeah, so I have to tell y'all this story. So when I went came down to Georgia, I was like, okay, I can do dietary aid again. I found a nursing, a nursing home here and the nursing home had roaches. 
I worked for one day. I was like, oh, hell no, I cannot do this. <laughs> so make sure you visit the nursing home that you're going to because some of these people are in nursing homes and it's not a good area. It's not a good environment for them. So why would you want to cook there? Why would you want to help them? Like, it just, ugh. Because the one I worked at down here, I was like, oh, hell no. And I needed money and I still was like, no, not doing it. And I left. So, if you all have any questions or want to know anything more about working as a dietary aid, comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate every single one of you. And don't forget to love yours. Love yourself. Love who you are because you're beautiful. Just the way you are. Have a good day. Bye, guys.